सो हाई दिस इज डॉक्टर जूहुल पटेल विश इज फ्रॉम पटेल्स मिनिमल एक्सेस गैनिकॉलजी सो दिस केस वॉज प्रीवियस थ्री एल एस सी एस ओके एंड एज यू कैन सी दिस इज वेंट्रोफिक्स यूट्रस इन केसेस ऑफ वेंट्रोफिक्स यूट्रस आई फील लाइक ऑल ऑफ यू शुड हैव अ प्रॉपर सर्जिकल एंड एटमिकल नॉलेज ऑफ स्पेस ऑफ फ्रेंसियस सो वॉट आई एम डूइंग इज हैव कम विथ माई इंस्ट्रूमेंट दैट इज शेयर and i keep on dissecting the tissue which is holding the uterus okay whenever i see a fat i keep on chopping below to the level of fat okay as you can see i have already reached to the lower uterine segment some sigma additions needs to be taken care of now coming on to the standard steps taking all three at least are together sealing at three levels cutting in between okay i'll be cutting both the leaf, both the leaves of broad ligament together till i reach isthmus now i am in vasico vaginal space once i have decided to vasico vaginal space bladder is in up down i'll come to the site of adhesion where bladder has got other to the previous section site now i keep on chopping the adhesions sending the bladder down okay now time for uterines to go so again i'll seal the uterine at three different locations like central medial and lateral okay. chopping in between now once i see the lumen i keep on chopping the tissue which is holding the lumen against the uterus in that way i can send my uterine down to the level of colpidomyosin as you all can see this lady has pretty long cervix i think she must have had prolonged labor top cervical history we don't know okay now we have successfully sent the bladder below to the level of colpidomyosin now my target is to send uterine more downer now i am chopping off the tissue which is holding the uterine against the uterus cleaning of my colpot me switching on to the other side Now myoma will come from right. It will come closer to the left coronal structures. Again, sealing at three different locations. And then cutting in between. I will keep on chopping. Keep on chopping both the leaves. Of, this is these are just bladder adhesions which needs to be chopped off. Once you have reached to this level, remember all the tissue above to the level of vessels needs to be chopped off. It belongs to bladder. I can see fat. So again, I'll keep on chopping all the tissue below to the level of fat. Okay. Now time for my uterines to go. chopping in between taking off all the vessels which are oozing now this is my uterine lumen okay once i see my uterine lumen i'll keep on chopping the tissue which is holding it against the uterus making my colpotomy free of uterine and all the vascular tissues to do the colpotomy as i told you before the best instrument what i like is unipolar 
need to be slow because unipolar doesn't have a ceiling capacity of to that extent so if you are slow it will coagulate also along its path This lady was posted for bilateral uh, salpingectomy and because she was around 40, I'll retain one of the ovary. Whenever I want to retain one of the ovary, okay, I always retain right one because left side is always tricky because this lady, if she comes up with the ovarian cyst, let's say in future, it is always easy to remove the right side than the left side because of the sigmoid. So whenever one ovary has to be preserved, just remember, remove the left ovary. It will make your next surgery smoother. This is a contralateral suturing. As I always tell my fellows, like whenever you are learning, learn the contralateral first because it is always easy than ipsilateral to reciprocate. While you do contralateral, always practice for ipsilateral because in cases of myomectomy, you need to have both the type of skits. Finishing up with the vault closure. I think it was a good case to discuss. Yep, thank you.